Hello everyone, welcome to Pam Reading Freya. This is going to be general reading for everyone under the zodiac sign of Gemini. Let's see what is important to know for you, Geminis, for the month of April. Geminis for the month of April. What is important to know for Gemini? I'm open to receive for Gemini. Gemini, what is important to know for Gemini? For the month of April. Okay, I cut the deck, begin pulling your cards. Okay, let's see what is happening with Gemini. Okay. Guidance. Guidance for Gemini. What is important to know for Gemini? Guidance. To receive for Gemini, we have past life. Um, this situation involves a uh, past life, okay? You will be dealing with past life situations in the month of April, Gemini. Guidance for Gemini. What is important to know for Gemini? We have healing family issues. So let's see what's going on with um, you, Gemini. So the first thing I begin seeing, okay, here in your reading is um, that you will be dealing either or had already be dealing, okay, with a woman that is uh, very sensitive, very, um, let me see, okay, that looks better, I think, uh, very sensitive, very um, psychic, very intelligent. Um, I do see that there has been situations in the which it's necessary for you to make up your mind, make choices. Um, this is telling me either you are going through a um, hurt situation, hurtful situations, or hard to deal with situations. But all this is um, because it's necessary for you to make a choice. This involves, um, do you want to be with me or not? Do you want to make efforts in this relationship or not? Are you compromising to a job or not? Um, this can be also including signing papers, uh, closing up deals. I see some of you, Geminis, if you are a man listening to this reading, um, you will be dealing with two different women. Um, one is very intuitive, very psychic. It's the type of woman that, that you cannot lie, okay? Or you could lie to her, but in reality, you are not lying to her. You are lying to yourself. I also see another woman very loving, caring. She is also very intuitive, but in a different way because the other woman moves more with her emotions, okay? It's very loving, caring and etc. things like that. Uh, when it comes to things and situations related to your home, I see that everything is going to be okay there. Um, I do see either you are losing the passion for something. This is something that you had initiated. Uh, for some of you, can be 45 days ago or a month ago, okay? It's like, okay, you, maybe you thought that something was a good idea or you felt that it could work. But you are finding out, yeah, I don't know, I just don't feel it, okay? It's like when you begin a new study and you quickly lose the interest or you realize, okay, um, this is not going to work for me. I also see you beginning new things, okay? Trying to. It's like you have ideas or are contemplating things for the future, but... Uh, you are waiting. It's like you are waiting for something, you are postponing or delaying for whatever reason you might have. To me, this is indicating, okay, if you want to make something happen, then take a stand. You don't have to finalize whatever you have in mind in, in a matter of days. Consistency and putting one foot in front of the other is what is going to work, okay? Is what is going to make things happen for you. I also see you dealing with situations, okay? This can be either in your workplace, in the family, or um, situations of cause and effect, okay? Karmatic situations. 
uh, this is telling me okay this involves a past life and if this is the case okay and you are dealing with two women at the same time this is not gonna go your way I see complications delays misunderstandings uh, also miscommunication okay now uh, if you are dealing with legal matters this is also once and again okay you better get your story straight you better know what you're gonna do how you're gonna do it and when you are going to do it because if not this is not going your way okay I don't see this ending in a way that you will say uh, I came on top of the situation I'm sorry I see you uh, feeling unhappy and like this is whatever is happening whatever is going to be happening in the month of April like you don't deserve that okay now I also see you okay it's like you tr trying to work and then you lose the passion working but you don't like it and then well maybe I can make it or this or that okay also uh, you trying to have all these new plans and ideas uh, maybe thinking that you wanna do something new but waiting for a period of period of time and then once and again retaking the idea okay I wanna do this and kinda getting on board with that uh, but this is something okay that either if it is uh, legal matters, entanglements, complications it's going to take you some time to resolve that it's going to not resolve immediately uh, for some of you I see eight weeks that would be two months and a half if, and for some of you I see seven months okay so be patient study face face does it okay don't try to resolve the world all at once okay now if you are a woman listening to this reading I see you dealing okay with a very loving man caring sensitive um, either you might have a meeting uh, with a with a lot of people or you are going to be dealing with a lot of a lot of ladies okay I see uh, three women around you um, the last one is very sharp tongue okay so be careful when it comes to the last woman because there can be either misunderstandings or there is something this woman is definitely coming toward you to say and express this is also telling me okay there can be some family issues that you need to deal with uh, this can be okay because you didn't deal with those family issues in the past in the month of April they're gonna come up they're gonna resurface and you're gonna be dealing with that okay life is, t is, uh, is calling on you for a change it's like okay you know what uh, Gemini something has to change you cannot continue on the same path that you had been you have to face what life is bringing you okay either if you have problems okay and you are dealing with them alone maybe it will be better okay that you communicate those problems to the family or to a friend to who wherever okay to who whatever you feel comfortable with I also feel that if you are dealing with divorces separation entanglements not only with one or two but three women it will be a good idea for you to get clear about what you really want to do also if this makes sense okay that you used to feel passionate about something or someone and you don't feel that passion anymore um, do not hide it okay uh, it is okay to express your feelings and emotions uh, but I do feel okay that this is not something that you will be able to cover up sooner or later this is going to come to the surface and you're gonna have to deal with it okay if you go through some situations in the month of April what you think is not fair or you meet someone or have problems in a relationship this is a karmatic situation okay this is indicating to me you deal with that issue in your past life and this time around okay it's going to be resolved not in your favor it's highly possible and the others a person's favor okay overall things will continue to move ahead for you I see a lot of back and forth okay a lot of he said she said she did she said this is problems and entanglements and complications 
This can also be arguments in between you and your partner, but I do see you resolving those, okay? If you have family issues, things that you have not talked about it and are necessary for you to heal, please don't ignore and put attention into that. Talk about what is important, okay? So Gemini, thank you so very much for allowing me to read for you. I wish you a wonderful month of April. Bye.